What up, everybody? Welcome back to Thief 2. This is Classic Gamer Dave. And we're about to enter the apartment section. We just finished the Necromancer's Tower, which was creepy as shit. But it's all good. Um, yeah, you want to be a little bit quiet here. Not super quiet, just be careful. Oh, I just realized that I didn't... I read the equipment tip about the armory, but I didn't read the loot tip. What's this say? Got some news for you. A guy named Valencia just entered Dayport. He's only there for a couple days. Oh, he's got diamonds. So basically, um, we want to go to the Dayport Traders Bank, and security there is pretty loose and relaxed. And yeah. Anyway, that's definitely like prime time loot. You don't want to miss that. We got this guy here. Um, I'm gonna knock him out. It's actually if you um, if he. Meet, meets up with the guys that are uh, um, ransacking this apartment here. What? Oh. If he meets up with them, they'll actually get in a fight and kill each other. They usually kill him before he kills them, so. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna have to do some flash bomb work here. Oh, you. I'm not deaf, you know. Come out. Okay. And I'm gonna leave that guy. Do his no, thing. There. So there's some loot in the chest, and then this thing. And I'm gonna leave. <laughs> I'm gonna let him keep looking for me. That's fine. What sucks is we missed out on a little... Garrett says, uh... <sighs> oh, what, is, what does he say? <sighs> Something about how quaint they're... Whatever. I, I can't remember what he says. Shit. Basically, he's just like, oh, how cute. They're just home wreckers, home robbers, or whatever. Home invaders, whatever. Whatever he says. Okay. So now we're pretty much done with all this stuff. Um, I don't think I've missed anything so far. But. So basically, we need to get into this place. There's nothing down there. Okay, whoop. Shit. Damn, is he throwing fire arrows? What? Fire arrows? Come on, shoot another one. Yeah, he's... He's shooting fire arrows, that motherfucker. Uh-oh. Get a flash bomb ready. Come on, coward! Face me like a man. <laughs> Where'd he go? But yeah, that that cup is the only loot you need. So goodbye. <laughs> when in doubt, just leave. They can't they can't follow you. Anyway, before we move on, we can actually go across these banners to the other side of the street here. Oh, careful. Oh god. <laughs> This is actually where the armory is over here. Um, we'll do that in a second, though. Uh, it's in that window right there. But first, we can actually go in this little greenhouse. Kill spider. Got him. You can read this little book if you want. It doesn't say too much. Yeah, I mean all these all these books are fun to read. Don't get me wrong, but I only I only read the important ones when I'm doing a recording. I think that's... These episodes could get way too long if I read every little thing, so... Whatevs. So we got a fine arrow in the wood there, and there's... There is a guy patrolling. I'll wait for him to turn around. Ooh. Okay. Don't know how he didn't see me, but that's fine. So there's our door. You can't open it. There is a key later in the mission, but like I said, by the time you get it, it's just like you don't need anything that's in there. Uh, and this just talks about how the door will never open. Wait, what did it say about a Burrick? Uh, I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to leave that there. don't need stuff clogging up my inventory. So grab the sunburst device. We're about to blow this shit right the fuck up. And then some fire arrows. Oh, one fire arrow. And bye. 
Got him. <coughs> so these are the most useful thing in here. More flash bombs. But, you know, water arrows, health potion... We got broadhead arrow, great. Noisemakers, mines. Mines are just about completely useless. The only thing they'd be useful for is um, getting rid of one of the the robots or whatever. The children of Karis. Yep, that's all that's in there. That's all that's over here, so... Now we can head back over the banners and move on to the next section of the city. Oop. Oh wait, I gotta go into this this building first. You can go through the skylight and make a whole bunch of fucking racket, or just jump down down here. I'm gonna try to knock this guy out. Got him. All right, cool. And the guy in here is just a normie. Ha! Uh, gotcha. Alright, I think that's everything. Moving on. Oh, uh, wait, did I go up? I haven't gone in here yet. I could probably do this on the way back, but... Um, nah, just do that now. Nothing too important. Fire arrow and water arrows. No big deal, but I like to get as much things as I can. As much things. Grammar is my strong suit, I promise. Let's see. Uh, there is a guard who has a key to this door, and he will be coming through here. But at the moment, I don't hear him, so I'm just going to go in myself. Ooh, there he is. There. Time to give yourself up. There he is. <laughs> Uh, yeah, there's another key. Um, so there's a, there's a safe across the hallway there that we need to open. <clears throat> this is the bank, by the way. <sighs> this is the bank. Um, so there's a safe, but it's controlled by a switch, and the switch is in this safe. So, like, a, a switch safe, a safe switch behind a safe, behind a lock door. Yeah, just throw that switch, go across the hall. But yeah, this is the biggest loot cache by far. I mean, look at all this shit. We've got a purse, we've got all these little... They look to be worth like 30-something? 25 maybe? I don't know. But there's a bunch. And we got our loot objective already. 1550. There you go. And if you read this, this note's actually kind of funny. Um... Don Valencia will be in the morning to pick up his diamonds. Make sure you log the transfer and extend every courtesy available. Valencia is not a client I want to use. Ba okay, well, that's not it. Um, <coughs> Lock the receipts in the safe this time or you'll taste the lash. Though I can't prove it, I suspect one of the night watchmen have of having sticky fingers. If not every penny is accounted for in the morning, it will come out of your backside. Um, I'm thinking he's going to be missing a couple pennies. <laughs> Poor guy's gonna get just hey, fucking lambasted. Okay, um, so this is probably the only. This is like one of two spots in the mission I can think of at the moment where I use moss arrows for sure. But yeah, that's definitely one of them. And then we'll toss him over here. Um, so we're at the. Trader's Bank facing this... Wait. Wait a minute. What? what? Oh, yeah. No, nah, no, nah, I'm confused. Anyway. Yeah, I'm not understanding the map. But basically, um, over that way is... Uh, there's no loot in that direction, like going, going there. So we're going to go this way. But on the way back... When we go back to the bell tower, I'll be going cutting through this way, so. Just FYI. There's nothing important over there, but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna skip it, guys. Come on. Alright, so here's another cool another cool section of the game. Or the mission. Oh! Who's that? Oh, he's gone! 
Oh, CMC left a little note here. Garrett, we hope the information we've provided you thus far has been useful. You do well to seek information at Angel Watch, but beware. All is not as it seems at the Mechanist Tower, and Karis is more aware of your actions than you may think. Still, there are ways to outwit him. It's kind of ominous, but uh, the Keepers say I'm on the right track, so that must mean I'm in good shape here. Uh, before you leave, though, here's another secret. We've got an invisibility potion and a gas mine, always useful. Some noisemaker arrows, not quite as useful, <coughs> but still good to have. Yeah, alright, we're almost to Angel Watch now. We're almost there, guys. This is the last real resident we have residential thing we have to go through. Who's there? Grab that vase. Did, did you say something? No need for alarm, ladies. What's Just that? passing Speak. through. That's right, ladies. Okay. <laughs> Grab her purse and the vase, and that's that's it. All right, cool. Oh my God, there it is, everybody! Angel Watch. We're almost there. <laughs> creepy, creepy building. Okay, I gotta show off this guy. This guy's drunk, but he's like a special kind of drunk. Keep it sure on. Last time I had, I was. I was messing around with this guy last time I played this mission, and uh, he started doing some weird stuff. Oh, like that. That right there. He's like, shit, come back here. <laughs> what is he doing? Okay. He's okay. just drunk. That's the only time I've seen this. <coughs> I don't think any of the other drunk guys do that. That weird walk that he just did. Oh, that's so, pretty weird. That's the castle of the future. Take my tenement any day of the week. Here it is. There's the angel. And it's watching me. God. That is creepy. Alright, we're here, guys. So it's actually super easy to get in. Um done. <laughs> that wasn't so tough. No? Even you... tower security isn't as tight as I thought. It's really not. It seems like it'd be crazy, like worse than the bank, but it's not. Nothing's worse than the bank. Um, so there's a little way to go upstairs if you'd like. Um, but I'm gonna go over this way. This takes you. That takes you over to the up to the second floor, I believe. But this takes you to or er, up to the third floor. This is the second floor. Yeah, there's six floors in total, so you want to make sure you visit everything. Uh, the guard on the office door shall be changed upon every three hours, though I trust that our guests shall not be curious enough to attempt entrance. That's the office I need to get to for the, the, so, 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 whatever the plans were that Karis had. I can't remember the set, set us plans. I, I don't remember. <laughs> yeah, anyway, uh, Vilnia has the key, whoever that is, so. Anyway, so here's the second floor. I'm going to go ahead and go right down to the first floor right away. There's not much you have to do on the first floor, but... Oh! Bye! Oops. Luckily, this is the only way down to the first floor, so they can't follow me. All right. So the first thing you'll notice, there's Karis, by the way, looking handsome. Message no. number one of six. So basically, people would be seated right here. On ooh, <laughs> ooh, pre-recorded message. Oh, my good guest, welcome to Angel Watch. I have gathered you here. Citizens of exceptional greeting for a fine and festive evening. The builder's work never ceases. Thus, I am not able to attend in person, but I am present in time and form, as you can plainly hear. From Vinia will be your host in my absence. Now, our evening together begins. So yeah, so, Karis doesn't even show up for his own party. 
so um that is actually one of our objectives it added an objective for us which is um activate all the voice machines and you hear that that thing said one of six so there are six in total um but yeah there's also some loot down here right at the front doors luckily there's only one robot and one guard down here pretty easy to avoid everything going on hello friend I'm gonna wait for him to turn around what is taking so long that robots gonna come back he's coming back are you serious oh great thank you just in time for me not to be able to come get Wow timing couldn't have worked out any worse hey robot Hi. <laughs> Wave at him with my blackjack. I guess I could, like, disable this Mac and then flash bomb that guy. But I'll be patient. I'll just sit here and wait. Hello. Okay. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna hope he doesn't turn around. Alright, cool. Got it. Yep, two little statues. I'm gonna put this guy... <coughs> Right where I was hiding. Boom. Discreet. There's no way anybody's gonna see that. <laughs> okay, and then wait for that guy to go by. Perfect. Okay, back to the second floor. Hopefully they um, have cooled down. There is an alarm system that can be activated. But I'm not sure it can be activated by um, guards or anything. I think you trip it when you when you do something bad. Oh, okay, no way to nowhere to hide here. God, I was trying to pick that guard up, not throw another flash bomb. Ah. Okay. I might just flash bomb him too. I've got plenty. I don't feel like I don't feel like waiting. Okay, and then there's the key on him that we can use in a second. I'm gonna put this guy away though. There, you guys have some fun. Yeah, let's grab that key real quick. Boom. All right, yeah. So we're done with the first floor. We're getting. Watch out for that robot. Here's a uh, three of six, I believe. Number, number three. three of six. Yep. That's only our second one. Let's sit and listen. The builder's great plan. The servants I am giving thee are examples of our strivings towards his ideals. His ideals. Mm. Servants. The souls behind the mask were lost and unproductive. Huh. Now they are models of efficiency. I wow. If only I could be there to share with thee the wonder of this moment. But I digress. On with the tour. Oh my god. He basically just said pagans were useless or whatever. And now they're being used for a better purpose. Which is mindless slaves. Karis is a pretty fucked up guy. Like, with the first game you had this... This... He wasn't, like, evil necessarily, the trickster. I mean, he was, but... He was just trying to put, like, balance into the world, I guess. I'm not sure exactly, but basically, Karis just is just an evil son of a bitch. Oh, here's a list of where the voice machines are. We just, we did the central concourse one and the chapel. So we got to do the library, dining room, gallery, and ballroom. Um, actually, the ballroom one isn't in the ballroom. It's in the uh, office. Oh, furthermore, forget not the machine for our special guest. Hmm. Wonder who that is. Anyway, so 
Uh, did I grab this? Yeah. Did I go in here yet? No. Okay. Uh, I don't think there's anything in this room, but if you go into the next one... We got some shit. Come on now. There we go. Uh, do we have a map? Ah, yes we do. Why does it say I've explored this? I mean, it's the elevator, but... Kind of weird. Anyway. Um, nothing up there. Now I think there's one more thing to do. I did that, right? Yes. Just trying to remember my way through this mission, make sure I don't forget anything. Pretty easy to do when I'm trying to make an entertaining video. Okay. Follow this robot for a second. Actually, I don't think there is anything else on the first floor here, so... There's nothing over there. Don't have to worry about going over there. I'm not even sure what those rooms are, to be honest with you. Okay. Nothing in there. So yeah, we're done with the second floor, so we're going up a level now. Yeah. In fact, I am going to go ahead and uh, stop the episode here. So next time, we'll do the third floor. We, we might even get all the way to the sixth floor in the next episode. We'll see what happens. Um, I'm going to try not to blackjack everybody. I'm, I'm going to try to only do it when necessary, but my blackjack finger is going to get a little itchy, and I'll probably just start knocking people out, so just so you're aware. <laughs> I think it's, it's really tough when they're all patrolling to move around quickly, um, and I like to keep things moving and concise, so we'll see. We'll see what happens, but that's next time. I'll see you then. Keep it clapping.